make this video addressing Senator Jeff Merkley. And I'd really like you guys to pass this around and maybe, hopefully, he'll see this on some level and understand some of the issues that I'm going to express in this particular video. You see, recently, this senator from Oregon decided to come film a 12 or 13 minute video of his misadventures down in my neck of the woods, Brownsville, Texas. You see, he came down here to try to gain access to what he called a children's detention center where apparently, according to him, children are ripped away from their families when they cross the border and put into cages, I guess, and treated like animals in this detention center. And he wanted to try and gain access to this. Of course, he was unsuccessful at doing so, but he nevertheless put this video out talking about how evil it is. And of course, in the video, he also has to mention that this is all happening under Jeff Sessions and, of course, by extension, Donald Trump, because I guess this is part of Donald Trump's America, his war on immigrants and brown people and everything else that the left and the Democrats love to say about the current administration. So, tries to gain access, makes a video, makes a big deal. What's the big deal? Why should I even be talking about this? Well, first and foremost, this is not his department, right? This isn't his constituency. Maybe he should stick to Oregon where he might actually know what's going on in his area. You see, because down here in this part of Texas, all the state level and federal level congressmen are all Democrats just like you, yet they know about this de detention center very well and they don't have a problem with it. You're just politicizing a situation you know nothing about. You see, because I do know what goes on with this detention center. I happen to know people who actually work there. And I'll explain to you why you're so wrong on so many levels about this particular situation. First and foremost, this was turned into a detention center, or as it's actually called, a children's center, almost four years ago, before Trump even announced he was running for president, back, you know, under Obama and Loretta Lynch. You see, that's who authorized this, ultimately, not Donald Trump or Jeff Sessions. That's the first thing you got wrong there, and that's really what you need to understand. Second, the reason that this facility is there isn't because we're ripping away children from their families and their, their mothers and fathers. No, you see, this detention facility, this children's facility, is specifically for kids that don't have family, that come across the border by themselves. And they not only need a place to stay before they get placed in the system where they can end up with a family or at some other uh, facility where they'll have uh, better schooling and education and that kind of thing, they have to have a place to go where they can get checked out for their health, okay? We had a big problem here on the border where diseases were coming across the border and ending up in schools with our kids. You see, and we down here, we didn't want that. So having a place where these kids can go and they're fed and they're housed and they're treated for, for any illnesses they might have, they're given medical attention, psychological attention, before they are then put on another path somewhere else where they actually can go to school and get placed with a family and all these other things, okay? Because see, we don't send minors back across the border, especially when they arrived here by themselves. We treat them, we house them, we clothe them, we feed them, and we get them ready in all capacities to be able to go on and hopefully be successful in life. That's what we do. That's what this center, not detention facility, that's what this children's center is for. Everybody down here knows what it's about. Everybody down here understands what it's about. No children are being mistreated. Nobody was ripped away from their families, as you like to imply. And no, this has nothing to do with Jeff Sessions or Donald Trump. So, Jeff Merkley, I would just like to end the video by saying, please, sir, go fuck yourself.